Yo, what's up fam? Calling all my Fremen, Sardaukar, and anyone in between because today we're dropping into the epic desert saga of Dune Part 2. Now, did it leave us wanting more water or was it a full oasis of cinematic goodness? Buckle up spice heads and get ready for a review that's hotter than a sun sword in July. But first things first, let's talk about this Dolby experience. Dolby Atmos was absolutely perfect to keep that balance between tiny details or dialogues on screen and still keeping. Right, now I gotta say, watching sandworms the size of skyscrapers rise from the sand on this screen felt like actually being on Iraqis. The sound design was insane, like having a sonic boom in your chest every time a friggin' spaceship blasted off. It was really intense, like, believe the hype. Speaking of intense, the action sequences in this flick are pure desert fire. We're talking laser beam light shows, night fights to the death, and Paul Atreides throwing down like there's no tomorrow. I saw some people online comparing the IMAX experience to being strapped to a rocket. This is like being on the rocket as it explodes. Now I ain't gonna spoil anything major, but let's just say there's a really cool moment in the movie where there's a sandworm fight scene that's gonna leave you speechless. The way they used the Dolby Atmos to make the sand feel like it was swirling around you, it was really crazy. I I think I felt the grain in my eye. Look, I'm not going to sugarcoat it. The story in Dune Part 2 is a bit on the dense side. There's a lot of political stuff going on and some serious philosophical discussions that might leave you reaching for your spice melange. But hey, that's kind of Dune's whole deal, right? It's not just a straightforward summer blockbuster. But the action? The visuals, the mind-blowing sound design, especially in Dolby? Those were all on point. If you're looking for a visually stunning, action-packed experience that's going to leave you feeling like you just rode a sandworm, then Dune Part 2 is definitely worth checking out. Just, you know, maybe brush up on your desert walk before you snag those Dolby tickets, fam. They're worth every spice coin. Anyway, that's all I have for this one. Um, What are your thoughts on Dune Part 2? Did you see it in Dolby or IMAX? Spice it up in the comments below. Otherwise, I'm going to check you all later. Peace.